You a vlogger, facing over You a queen when I less than I'm a goose Oh wami, oh wami Oh wami, oh wami Oh wami, oh wami Oh wami, oh wami Hi Ninjas, how are you doing? So we're starting this vlog, right? We're starting the vlog. We're going to the awards. Um, and so we're going to Pretoria. I do hope that I will still be able to catch the red carpet. Um, I, I had to work. Even though it's a Saturday, I had to work first. But at least I'll be there for the actual awards. So I'm super happy about that. We did get VIP tickets. So I'm going with Sissy. Um, and so, yeah. So this is us going there and it's my first time obviously um and like going to this award so it's the nigerian excellence award i don't know if that's the name but that's the gist of it right so i cannot wait to like see um who are the people that are getting awarded what are they doing and also just to network um you know also just to network but the the I don't know if I should say that I'm the host is actually a friend of mine who is Creek Boy and a lady from South Africa. I don't know who that one is, but um, Creek Boy is actually the host, so super excited for that. Um, but yeah, we're gonna see how it all goes. I'm super excited, so let's go to Pretoria. someone that was dressed in a very Nigerian attire and I assumed is also going to the to the awards and I asked and I was like sorry are you going to the awards I was like yes and I'm like do you know which floor it is and I was like it's only one floor up and I was like okay thank you and I, I feel like I sensed he maybe got it I don't know maybe thought I was like working I profiled but I was right <laughs> But anyway, oh, the light. So, I don't think at the hotel they'll be allowing uh, filming. So, we'll film when we're in there. Guys, guess who I just bumped into immediately arriving? Mr. Lugumbro. <laughs> Dixie with the capital letter D. I'm with my spank B. And let me. Wow. Can I spank? <laughs> That's question every day. Everyone is gonna be like, "What is going on with you?" But he looks so handsome. Let me give you, let me show you guys him, head to toe. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. You're a mess. He's literally a whole mess. So let me also show you guys who is. His co-host. 
wait let's 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 go for the lighting she's so gorgeous the ah, gold see, see, the why, why, why am i res surrounding myself with so beautiful women that's why guys are always asking questions yeah. dixie where are you getting these women i'm just a bad boy Imagine. she always said that we came to him he didn't come to us you are welcome. Thank you. Oh, I love you too, mommy. Mm. Mm. Oh, yes. Because we have to go with the time. <laughs> we have to go to the zest. Wait. Um, you were saying, uh, uh, why well, your sister is always doing mistakes? <laughs> <laughs> she always just she always she, she always calls him on my phone. Like if always. she wants to call someone, she will call him and then he will like she will buzz him and when he calls back, I'm like, my sister made a mistake. Oh she will like video call him and stuff, so I don't know. Yeah, no, it's a mistake. Yeah. It's, it's just that I'm just in the speed die, you understand? I mean if, if, in case you are you need somebody to call, I'm here cry come cry on my shoulder. I'm I am i am the spend daddy, you understand? Come cry. Daddy, call me daddy. Jesus <laughs> of Nazareth. I'm so happy seeing you, man. I miss yeah. you. I really miss you. I can, please, it's been a while I see you. Well, I really miss you. Because he went to Durban and met new big Nyash then he didn't want to talk to me anymore. No matter how the Nyash is bigger, this connection cannot be broken. She's my African queen. <laughs> <laughs> no, I will see you in Alright, okay, sure, sure. Okay, sure. Ah, well, anyway. That's a creep boy. I told you guys, like that's the only person I know. So I'm not sure if I should vlog or not, but we'll talk. Let me just leave the room first because I wanna be putting people out there. I like it too. Watch and look at be careful. This this marriage is a ticket. They want money, come collect. They want more, more money, oh. They want more, more money, oh. I just want be long people. I know only one person.
Hi guys, I am home. So I want to give you guys the 419. I actually, I mm, want to drink some water because I did have some wines. But I'm back from the hours and I did post a picture. So I want to like just be in my bedroom because there's like better lighting in here. When we left, we were just all in a hurry. So yeah, I want to give you guys the 419 of what happened. Okay, so the lighting is trash because... I am in my room. Um, I think my ring light is in the car and I don't want to go down there. <laughs> I don't want to go downstairs, but hi guys. How are you doing? Um, the pearls are off. Um, but wow, I am from the awards. So what happened was that I did post a picture on Instagram and I saw a lot of you guys or rather i saw someone actually saying that i cannot wait for the 419 sort of like you know for what uh to get a video on what happened um and i was like okay after the vlog i should just you know as i wrap up sit down talk to you guys because obviously i didn't get to talk to you guys when we were still there um but wow <laughs> wow okay so I'm going to go ahead and just start off by, if you guys do remember, I once uh, had an interview, right? Um, I had an interview with this gentleman right there. Um, his name is Mr. Olani Abo Dedele. Yeah, okay. So um, about three months ago, I should say, or rather almost four months, I started having a lot of, um, you know, women that are Nigerian wives, Nigerian soon to be ex-wives, I should say. Some were already ex-wives. And the things that they were just saying about their husbands, soon to be ex-husbands and ex-husbands was scary, okay? It was wild. Now, he decided that he was going to come just because he felt um, there's a side of Nigerians that is never spoken of, of a community of Nigerians that actually stay in South Africa. So when uh, my PA told me that, you know, she, w she got contacted, that someone wants to come, I said, hey, he can come. Everybody has got a right to share um, you know, their story or talk about it. So he did come and obviously we had to sit down. And after that, um, he did say that, you know, they were about to have like the Nigerian Community Excellence Awards um, and he would like to invite me. So on camera, I did say that, well, I would definitely come. And so he did send through, um, you know, the tickets, the invite basically. And then, uh, yeah, you know, I honored the invite, which was tonight okay i'm from there um and i just wanted to tell you guys like what happened in there so first of all i do have to say that to the organizers chef's kiss guys chef's kiss i could not fault anything like and you lot know i like to be like mm, but i could not fault anything the venue first of all mwah, gorgeous okay the decor mwah, gorgeous like the way that the setup was everything was just so beautiful they even had this uh system where usually when you go somewhere they will have like you know the 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 the, the screen um be showing like the front but they actually had different cameras like whatever um film crew that was being used is absolutely amazing because you could be sitting there looking forward and on the screen you're actually seeing something that is happening at the back or something so different angles it was really honestly just beautiful honestly they had drones like they even had a drone in there cha i was like <laughs> you know so um i got two tickets so obviously i did take my baby sister and uh we were sitting at table eight which is literally the third row from the front um i did really not take that for granted so thank you so much mr olani okay 
<laughs> hopefully i'm yeah olani so thank you thank you so much i really did uh, appreciate that you know he didn't just invite us and shove us at the back <laughs> not that anyone that was at the back was shoved but i'm just saying that i did appreciate the fact that you know i'm um, were able to 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 just be seated um close to what everything was going on the other thing again that i have to say is that in the vlog you will have seen me there's a time that he did come so he did acknowledge us um you know just to say oh you know welcome all this so it really honestly was something that was great honestly i just i loved it <laughs> and you know um so the other thing again that i have to say is that um it was very inclusive you know as much as it was celebrating nigerians um it also was very inclusive in terms of um they were not like playing uh you know foreign songs like when i say foreign songs i'm talking about songs that we do not know um if you guys know me you'll know that um uh, uh, uh you know um afro beats is my favorite genre of songs so um yeah i know i knew almost every single song that was being played there but even if you were someone that didn't listen to nigerian music like that um you would actually know the songs that they were playing because it's your tiktok songs you know your tiktok songs so i found that they were very inclusive in that they also did throw in a bit of south african music in there as well so that was also great ah the host creep boy out did himself with and tabi saying like they just really did such a great job and as i'm saying like they really wanted it to be a south african i mean a nigerian celebration but also acknowledging like the south african community so the host it was a south african and a nigerian so creek boy obviously is a nigerian and tabi saying is a south african so i did find that that was really just well thought the other thing again is that when you got there on your table you did i mean on your chair so every chair um had this like on the table but for every chair you you actually got this i did take mine home um just because i found that this one is still something that is so brilliant it's a whole book at the back they also have like all the um you know they had like their sponsors and stuff and you know it has got different people's um information and pictures and names um let me show you guys the one where they even like literally put like creep boy and tabi saying who were the hosts there and you know um they they spoke of like who creep boy is who tabi saying is so i did really honestly find that this was something that was really great hey um the quality of this like proper proper like just proper okay um the so like as i'm saying like the organization was honestly just top tier okay um the other thing again that i have to say is that you know um and i okay this is just me people were not like branded up people were not like louis gucci what what people were like dressed beautifully but very professional you know um everyone like people that were there guys like they were dressed beautiful i guess maybe expensive i don't know maybe it was brands that i do not know but everyone was just dressed like normal like normal business with men and women you know you working people you know so yeah because in the interview he did say that you know that's just for the nigerians that you guys see um in the community that of is of people that actually like earn their money proper mostly that is not the norm you know and so i i will say that i did see that today um the other thing again that i can also say is that uh people were just so professional like when it came to like let's say the food right going to eat because it was a buffet food drinks alcohol uh dessert everything and i do have to say that you know as i'm getting to what i wanted to say where i was seated next to this gentleman and his wife um and i do have to say that sir if you ever watched this video oh my gosh like <laughs> it came through like he was making sure that we were all sorted guys like if the guy that is passing with like drinks he's taking for us putting there he's doing this is doing that so the cups were full the the glasses were full 
be it alcohol, be it juice, be it cool drink. Like, it was just full. Like, that was, like, just wow, you know. But when it came to, like, time for us to go dish up, as I said, it was a buffet. Um, We went row by row. You never saw anyone from the last row um, entering, trying to do whatever. People were just so professional there. And that's something that I honestly do have to say that I saw. And it was just, everything was just nice. The other part, again, that I have to say, security was on par. So, as you can see, my 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 dress has got like sort of like one arm and it's long and if i'm wearing this you cannot see so as i was walking in they were like he closed the door and i had to be like and then he said, smiled and opened so without this you were not entering so you know this was not just done so that you can be able to just you know um uh, uh, uh wear it for no you like you were literally was strictly uh entry by invitation the other thing again is that um so you know it's the it's the small things that honestly count um so there was like two doors to the entrance and then the time that we had to now start you know going to get food and stuff just to maintain um order one door was to go in the other was to go out you could not go in with the door of going out you couldn't go out with the door of going in like everything was just so thought you know everything was just so thought out so the whole thing was really honestly just so brilliant i don't even want to lie i'm super super impressed i'm a thousand percent um impressed um and i do i did say because there's a time that mr olani did go and speak and you know i i do get i do get um what he and uh the others amongst that community are trying to do is the fact that as much as you know they do not make the noise um and you know maybe are the ones that are known and stuff like that um because you know the image that we have of nigerians is oh you know drug dealers or scammers or this and this and that um but there are actual nigerians in the country that are doing and earning an honest living and so you know they were just also encouraging each other to say that listen we also need to be heard we also need to be seen and i was like i do admire that that was something that was really good um so yeah i do have to also say that guys i felt so underdressed i went out shopping to look for a dress yesterday so mr olani please invite me again next year i want another rematch <laughs> let me go come back with myself properly put together you know but honestly overall the event was amazing it was amazing like the thought that went into that was just crazy you know um so in the beginning when it started before creek boy and tavisen came out who were the hosts as i said um there was a video of theirs that was played the you know this and that and then they had this grand entrance everything was just so beautiful everything was just so beautiful everything was just so beautiful um and also um what did i want to say Oh, you know, the, we had eggs in between, um, you know, people that were getting their awards, but they were like eggs. Um, you know, there was this young boy that came in, performed very good. His music is good. There was also um, Angel Gabriel, who is a comedian. He is so funny. We could not stop laughing. Like that was just brilliant. Like everything was just brilliant. So, yeah, I really honestly have to say that out of a 10, I do give them like a 100 out of a 10. Like, they outdid themselves, okay? Um, and, oh, I also have to say congratulations to Creep Boy. Um, he did win. I think this is his first award. So, I was laughing at him and I was like, welcome to award-winning content creator game. <laughs> you know um but congratulations for winning your first um you know um award uh because that literally certifies you like award winning you know so it really honestly was great um to just see that moment for him um and yeah everything else was just really great i went with cc my baby sister and oh she enjoyed herself so much she was dancing we were dancing it was really just so nice it really honestly was just so nice and it was so much fun and i do have to say so yeah overall and above um chef's kiss thank you so much for inviting me um and uh yeah i did see what you know he was talking about the place was packed hey and as i'm saying like respectable 
businessmen and business women okay so basically that is that i think before i actually leave i will go ahead and just say that for me um unless if you're someone that is xenophobic which you shouldn't be um I, I wouldn't see anything wrong with us staying with people from different countries as long as we both stay good together in harmony you know if you're not out there robbing people you're not out there killing people you're not out there doing this and that you are actually a um a member of society um you know that is functioning you know i don't like i honestly don't see um anything wrong with it like that's personally me you understand what i'm saying so i really honestly did enjoy myself i really really enjoyed myself i will not lie it was so nice i cannot stop raving about it so i do have to say that great work mr olani um and thank you so much for actually inviting us that was really really nice um i don't know i should maybe check what time it is and show you guys literally it's like 14 minutes past 12 right now so <sighs> it is what it is i'm sure i'll edit this tomorrow so that you guys will be able to get it because or when i wake up because now i have to take my shower and go to bed but yeah i'm really like exhausted because we were dancing it was nice everything was just nice they also did have an after party uh where they were going to main lane but ciao I was exhausted, so I just had to come home. I know I feel old, <laughs> you know, I really do. Um, but uh, yeah, it was a tough week, it was a tough, tough, tough week. Um, and I just didn't want to go and be tired then, stuff. So I'm gonna just go ahead and rest. But thank you so much for the invite, and yeah, it really honestly was great. Please do go ahead and comment down below what you guys think. Did you enjoy it? um and are there any things that actually shocked you do you guys have any more questions i'm also like trying to think of what else i don't think i can say any other thing except for it was really great it really was so yeah i'm from one minute for i love you guys stay blessed and i will see you guys my next upload Mwah.